Hello, everybody. Hey. Welcome. Um, so, yeah, we're going to be doing something a little different today. Uh, but, yeah, we're actually up at Adam's Cabin doing some recordings, and uh, we were trying to figure out what we wanted to record, and I was like, I only find a trivia game on, on, on the internets. So we uh, went to this website, and I found this thing called Action Quiz, where you uh, play against uh, computer opponents, which we have over here with our good old Joe from Unknown. Lucia from Spain and uh, Miguel. Miguel. Miguel from uh, Portugal. But yeah, we made our guy here. Uh, we could change the picture if you want to change it, but I thought the uh, the good old black hair and black beard looked pretty decent. And Andy was a history major in yes. high school. I uh, and in college. I loved history. Well, I still love history, but I yeah, I went to college and I got a double major in history and social studies. So I picked general history mixed quiz so hopefully this doesn't make me look terrible but yeah let's go ahead and start so uh, we haven't played this yet so uh be interested to see uh ja jane wyman and nancy oh this there wait this these was were the spouse of which oh uh okay uh, I know no. Ronald Reagan's wife's he... name was Ran Nancy. Yeah, I was going to say, I thought that... I don't know that he was married before that. I don't know either, but that seems like a good guess, because I remember Nancy as well. Ha-ha! <laughs> yeah! They all got the same thing. <laughs> what type of warplane do you see here? Uh, oh, uh, oh gosh. Well, that's definitely when they started developing jet engines, so that would be after World War II. I don't know what the I don't know name what it's called. would have been, though. I, Are we timed? I don't think we're timed. I think you lose points for you the probably amount do. of time that it takes you. Maybe. Um, I'm not sure. Point value uh, is 609. Gosh. I'm going to uh, go with... Well, my guess is short sterling, but I'm not sure. I'll meet you in the middle. Well, let's go ahead and do that. That was wrong. Gloucester, Gloucester Meteor. Meteor. Okay. okay. No! no! Why did they all behind. get it right? <laughs> Okay, this is a very brief summary of which treaty. 1948 Defense Pact by the UK, uh, France, and Benelux? Well, the only thing I could have think of is... Uh, the Brussels I'm, one is I'm the only thing sure I can think of. I'm pretty sure NATO but... was developed after World War II, but... Attempt Corjon... I thought you were good at history. Well, you know, I haven't had to practice it since I quit teaching. <laughs> treaty of Sir... That's... Treaty of Brussels is possible because Belgium was affected by World War II at the beginning, but I feel like it actually might be one of the two top ones. Let's go with Treaty of Brussels to see. Yeah! yeah. Good! Good guess, Adam. We're still... Hey, we're beaten! Ah, go. fuck you, Miguel. Uh, this person is or was a leader in which country? President Christina Fernandez de Kirch Kirchner? Oh my. Well, president, so it'll be a democracy. Quote unquote. <laughs> uh, oh my, this is a. Uh, well, it's focusing mainly on South America. They're all South American, yes. So, I guess. I my guess I... is, is Colombia. Yeah. Um... But that means it's probably Argentina. Or Mexico or Brazil. No. <laughs> um, oh my. Okay, well, what do you think? Do you want to go with Colombia or Argentina? My guess was Colombia. So go with Argentina? Yes. Okay. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> that, that, that definitely works. My Sweet. actual guess was Argentina. <laughs> In which year did all these events happen? Sharpeville Massacre in South Africa. Brazil moves capital to New City, Brasilia. European Free Trade Association is established. A corda photo of Che Guerva. Coronation Street debuts Nixon-Kennedy TV debate. I, and, I would uh, think it'd be 1960. Well, because... Nixon-Kennedy debate was the first TV debate. Ah. Uh... Uh, Kennedy was assassinated in 62. 63. 63. So he, so he would have been president. It might be the 60s. 1960, exactly. They're all 60s. Well, I'm sorry. I'm just trying to. <laughs> I 
That's what I said in the yeah. first place. It's sixty or sixty-two. Because he would have had to then. This he was be... dead by sixty-six and sixty-eight. Yeah. So it's gotta be. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Yep. Sweet. We're fucking leading that Joe shit. Joe drops out. Yeah, you bitch. Finland. Where did this country be, become independent? When? when oh, what? It... Uh, Finland from Russia. Is uh, that what it was nineteen forty-seven. I don't really know. Well, they picked up more they picked up a bunch. territory after World War II because they wanted buffering zones. Yeah. Because they were sick of getting invaded by Germany. That's what you put, happens when you put your capital right on the border. Yeah, I know. But then Germany is not, well, didn't, wasn't really smart with invading multiple times during a century and getting screwed. Yeah. Um, yeah. Oh, gosh. Well, it has to be before World War II for sure. Could have been after World War One. Well, this wasn't quite when World War One ended. I'm, I have a feeling it's one of the two top ones. Twenty-seven. Twenty-seven. Damn, that's seventeen. 17. Oh no! I okay. didn't know if Finland was ever part of Russia. What type of war plane do you see here? God. Um, My brother-in-law. What is that bottom stuff. right one? Big you, 50, oh. <laughs> can you read that for me, Andy? Uh, you know, Fajat? <laughs> uh, that's, <a, laughs> that's an interesting name. I mean, it's missing a G to be too bad. Uh, but... Yeah. It's U.S. Air Force, it says on the side. I don't so think it's a... I guess... It wouldn't be a MiG, then. No, MiG would be Russian. I don't ones. think it's the, ch the Thunder Chief. Republic. I feel like that one's more triangular. Well, but I think the Fs are usually what they're more triangular. Amer are you about to look it up on your phone? No, I'm not cheating? going to. I was looking at the time. Okay. My guess is the Vigan. Go the Vigan. That's my oh, okay. It oh well, it was the one that we we're picking on. You said How it said U.S. That? I didn't think U.S. flew MIGs. I didn't think so unless we sold it. <laughs> Probably. Which conflict occurred in this these years, 1880 to 81? First Italian War of Independence. Um, Second Franco, it's Franco America. Franco Spaghettios guys. War, right? First Italian War of Independence. Uh, I, I have no idea which first Opium War. You picked history. I know. I didn't think it was gonna be this intense. I should have picked American history. Um, Opium War. Oh shoot, we're really falling behind. Still have uh, quite a few questions to answer. Which war conflict happened in this Cambodian year? Cambodian Civil War. Well, I would end up saying. Not. I don't know. Mau Mau Uprising? But, oh my gosh, this is stupid. Uh, well, you want to go with Cambodian Civil War? That was my guess. The last time we got it right when we went against it. Let's go with my my uprising. Nope. Greek. <laughs> I wouldn't get booted out of this game. Hey, we're falling way behind. This person is or was a leader in which country? Prime Minister Piet de Jean. Oh What's wait. That? Oh never mind. I'm thinking of French else. name, so I'm thinking South Africa. Well, it's not a bad guess. Even though that's I think that's English, but whatever. They have weird names there. South Africa. Shit. Netherlands. Damn. You lose! Oh, man. We didn't make it very far. We made it the 10 out of 15 questions. Well, let's try a different category, and uh, we'll do another episode of this. Okay, yeah, well, I'm down for that. All, All right, right, so see we'll guys. see you guys in the next one. Bye. Bye.